Today we will look at how to install a Challenger door travel trailer latch, how to take it out and install a new one in its place if it is defective. First open the door, then take the plunger cover off. There's two screws that hold the plunger cover. Take those screws off and lay the plate aside, lay the screws aside. <clears throat> There are four screws on the inside of the latch that need to be taken out in order to remove the latch. Back out all four of those screws. You might want to leave one screw in and then hold um, the latch in place when you remove the last screw. Be careful so it doesn't fall. Um, and hold both sides of the latch with your finger as shown and then remove the screw and set your dr drill down remove both sides of the latch remove the inside then the outside you might need to wiggle a little bit to get out of the um, door <clears throat> now you're ready to install the new latch um, take the new latch insert it into the hole from the outside once again you need to plunge your side first then you can just push it in place like shown and once you have that in place line up the deadbolt on the bottom side you can the little red handle on the inside might need to be turned the right way in order to get it on there once you have that lined up the inside back plate should fit right onto the inside of the outside door hold it in place while you grab a screw and you can might be a little tricky to line up the screw holes from the inside and the outside of the latch. <clears throat> Handle the um, screws with your fingers. If you start them with your fingers, it might work better than starting with the drill. And, and like I said, this might be tricky. It might take a couple minutes to get everything lined up right. Look like, looks like our technicians having a little bit of issues getting this thing lined up. If you hold the latch in place with both hands, look at it and put a screw in its place and start it with your finger. Once it's started into the outside plate, you can see where the screw goes if you look at it closely, then you can tighten it up. Start the one screw, don't all, tighten it all the way, this will make it easier to um, line up. And do the, the next screw, line that one up, the bottom screw, line that one up, and the last screw, tighten that up. Now, once you have the screws tight, make sure you look at it and check to make sure that the latch is lined up and even with the door. To make sure it's um, perpendicular with the floor or it um, lines up with your trim. Now you put your plunger cover back on, install the two re, um, recessed screws into the plunger cover, fasten that, <clears throat> check the door for function. You see the latch isn't perfectly straight. All you need to do if you need to straighten it up is loosen it up just a little bit on the inside. Just back a couple turns on each screw will loosen it up. The last screw, loosen that up just a little bit, and then you can line it up and make sure it's straight into the door. And once it's straight, you can tighten the screws back up, and then you want to close it again. Check, make sure it looks good. If it looks good, that's how to install a travel trailer latch and a Challenger door, door entrance door.